Yesterday, a customer was asking me, they say, I'm so tired of that spot. I really, they are not going. What can I do? Uh, most of us uh, black girls, we really suffer from dark spot, hyper uh, pigmentation, uh, acne scar, like at least once in your life. I'm sure about this. Even me included. I've suffered from uh, acne scar for a good five years. It's horrible. It's something, it's something that is really difficult to live with and I know that. Uh, in today's video, we are going to talk about that and I'm going to give you guys five tips to get rid of all your dark spot or your acne scar. So stay tuned. You might want to watch this video. Hello beautiful people. Welcome to my channel. <laughs> Uh, my name is Esenam, uh, please call me Ese, and um, on this channel, we talk about beauty, we talk about hair, we talk about appearance, we talk about health. We, we give tips, we give advice to be able to help you to enhance your natural beauty. Uh, if you have been here with us before, it's so nice to see you. How are you doing, beautiful? Uh, I'm so glad to see you again. Uh, I just started this channel and I'm so, so grateful for your, for your support, for your comment, for your likes, for your share. Oh, thank you so much. God bless you all. And if you are just joining us for the first time, you're also very welcome. Glad to see you here. Uh, please feel free to subscribe to uh, this channel. That way you will not miss any of our videos. Uh, we are going to come up with so many great, 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 great videos about skin, about hair. So feel free to join the community, right? Thank you so, so, so much. Uh, without wasting so much time, I'm going to jump into today's topic. So first, I'm going to go ahead and talk about hyperpigmentation. What is hyperpigmentation? It's when something causes your skin to pro uh, produce more uh, melanin than usual. It's when something like triggers or something uh, double the production of the melanin in your skin. Uh, next, we are going to talk about melanin. What is melanin? Melanin is a pigmentation. It's a pigment that it's found in a, is in a human organism. It's a, it's a natural pigment. So uh, melanin will, will determine if you're going to be very dark in complexion or if, you, if you're going to be very light in complexion. So it's known that Africans and Af uh, African Americans has a higher concentration of melanin and Asian, Asian people have a bit more than Caucasian and then Caucasian have a bit, a bit more than um, albinos. It's a, it's a natural pigment it's, it's, uh, and melanin is also known to, to be a very, a very good uh, pigment because it helps to, to it make the skin stronger. That's why it's known that uh, African has a, a bit stronger skin than uh, other people. Uh, that's why, for example, they will age a bit more slower. They will age better. And there's a saying that black don't crack. <laughs> Is that true? I think a little bit because uh, melanin, uh, melanin, and of, of course there's also other factors, but one of them is like uh, that melanin help skin to age better and it also a sun protection. I think having a melanin in your skin is a good thing. It make your skin uh, more stronger, you age better, but it's also a really big problem. Why is it a problem? Because everything can actually trigger the production of that mel melanin. Uh, one of the things that really triggers the production of your melanin is the sun. Of course, it's known that uh, when you are exposed to the sun uh, for a whole day, right away you become uh, darker than you were before you actually go out. That's why in the summer days, you realize that your skin is much more darker than in the winter 
uh, in the winter time that's normal that's normal for every skin type every skin uh, every skin complexion i mean africans asian uh like europeans it's it's all the same it's all the same so melanin really affects all of us what i want you to know is that uh there there are different kind of hyper pigmentation and the causes the causes of the hyperpigmentation are different but the one i want to talk about today is that uh, post-inflammatory hyperpigmentation what does it mean it's uh is a uh, hyperpigmentation that comes uh after your skin has been inflamed uh, for example acne can cause uh, hyperpigmentation and that's what we want to talk about today uh, so I'm going to go ahead and tell you five tips that can really help you to get rid of that hyperpigmentation uh, which is acne scar the first tip wear a sunscreen oh I cannot say that enough I cannot I cannot say that enough you have to wear a sunscreen whether you are African whether you are Caucasian whether you are Asian uh, it's proven that the Sun can cause damage to your skin uh, you can see uh, like anytime like I said before anytime you are exposed to the Sun your skin becomes darker that means it actually uh, triggers the production of your melanin if you want to get rid of acne scar you need to wear a sun protection how does it help you like i said before if you don't wear a sunscreen the production of your melanin will be doubled and for somebody that have an acne scar is some of the things you really want to avoid you want to avoid it because of obviously if you are getting if you are trying to get rid of darker area of your face and you still not protecting your 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 skin to uh, for getting more darker then obviously you cannot get rid of them uh, anyway everybody should be even wearing uh, sunscreen is that that's not just the only reason but especially for people that suffer from uh, dark spots uneven skin that's a no that that's something you can't avoid you can't avoid and i know a lot of uh, dark skin people like me they, they really don't feel like wearing it because of course their skin is strong they don't get burned and so so much so much but the reason that your skin your dark spot is not going there is because you're not wearing your sunscreen so please uh beautiful make yourself a big favor include a good sunscreen in your skincare regimen the second tip i'm going to give you is that don't press your pimples uh it's something that i've heard when i was young uh, i like i said i suffered from acne for a good five years and uh, people always used to tell me don't press your pimples don't press your pimples when you have a pimple in your face all those cream that can help you to just you know you can just put it on the acne and it will dry on, on itself is the much is a much more better way to get rid of acne if you like to press your pimples you you realize that uh the infection inside the pimple it will touch another side of your face and that will cause another acne and they will keep popping out of your face so the good way look for acne treatment and just put it on your acne and allow it to dry for itself don't 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 press it uh pressing your pimple uh it will make them to be uh, uh inflammate and it will make the scar to be there for quite long and if you have dark skin especially this is for you our scar doesn't just go easily you know a caucasian skin can actually press pimple uh, he will have scar but it will go a bit faster because of course the concentration of melanin that he has in his skin is not the same as you so beautiful please don't press your pimple don't press them the third tips i'm going to give you is that exfoliation is your friend but i'm going to i'm going to just give you as a tip now um as someone that is suffering from hyperpigmentation acne scar exfoliation is something you should include in your skincare regimen uh 
if he wasn't doing it before or if you didn't do it uh, more frequently you need to do uh, and one thing I can also tell you about that is that you need to look for exfoliation that is not harsh so you can use it more often for example look for chemical uh, exfoliation that you can just apply on your face and allow it to to work for for about 15 10 minutes depending on the product and then you rinse it out and you continue your 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 treatment as you you do often so include that in your regimen do it even two to three times but make sure the exfoliation that you are you are you are getting is mild it's not harsh to cause your to, to cause your skin any damage include a vitamin c serum in your skincare regimen now vitamin is uh is well known to to really help the dark spots it will help you gradually to to get rid of them and you know uh when it comes to dark spot or hyperpigmentation there's no one miracle product that you can use that will just remove it all you need to it's, it's, it's actions and it's all the product you use the the way they work together to help you clear your skin so just look for a good vitamin c serum and include it to your to your routine that will really much help you the last tip i'm going to give you beautiful is that run away from hydroquinone and all those light uh, skin lightening ingredients that are very strong if you are looking for a clearer skin you need to go for more natural product run away from uh, hydroquinone it doesn't it wouldn't it will not help you it will just make your your skin worse or it might even maybe help you at the beginning but your skin will come back and be uh, more dark spots will come back and 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 so on so run away for that I know that is something that can be very frustrating uh, let me just be very honest uh, if you want to get rid of that you need to be patient especially if you are if you have dark skin like mine you just need to be patient you need to to be very regular in your skincare regimen you need to do it you need to just uh, stick to it you need to use the product and then you need to be patient you need to be patient so that's all the the tips i have for you today and i'm very sure if you apply those your skin you get a clearer skin uh, i'm sure because i've i've gone through it and today i'm able to go out without makeup i'm more comfortable with my my skin and i know that's what you're looking for so that's it uh so beautiful people that was all for what i wanted to talk about today uh if there's any other question that you feel like asking me if there's something else you want to know uh please please leave it in the comment i'll be i'll be so glad to answer and also uh have you had a dark spot before have you suffered from acne how did you clear it i would really want to know that please leave comment leave a comment even if you didn't have it how do you keep your skin let let us know i think it will help other people to, that are watching this video your comments will be will be helpful for them beautiful if you have been here until now i'm so glad you stayed and thank you so much for watching the video thank you for spending the time with me please feel free to comment and uh, if you find this video useful share share with your friends and uh, you know enjoy yourself stay beautiful stay confident and i'll see you again in my next video Bye-bye.